Hello friends. So in this today's session, I am going to show you how you guys can recover your WordPress password. So it is so easy. It is not so complicated. Okay. So how I can do that? I will. This is my main domain. I will put slash and admin. You can put wp admin, wp login dot php. So it will re redirect you towards the login area. So I don't remember my email or username or password as well. So what I will do, I will click on lost my password, but I don't know about my email as well. So what I can do, I will open that domain again in another tab, and I will put cpanel or sorry, cpanel or I can put colon 2083. So this socket can redirect towards you the login area. So here I can log in like my username and I will put my cpanel password over there as well. And now you can see I am logged in. Okay. So what I am going to do now. So I will go for the Softaculous. Here I have installed the Softaculous. I will click on this WordPress manager by Softaculous. I will click on manage users. And here I can see the email as well. So email is admin at the hosting mod dot shop. So that is the way by using we can recover our password using email. I can click on this and I can open this into a new tab and I will go for the email accounts. And here I will see I don't have created the email with the admin at the hosting mod. I can create an email with the name of admin hosting mod dot co or dot shop so email has created now i will copy this email and i will put it over there so now it is saying like confirmation link has been sent to your email i will not check my email i will open it round cube yes see i have received my password to reset my wordpress password i have received the link so here I can put any password. I'm just going to copy this password to show you. This is my password and username is I think admin. We have found this from here by clicking on manage users. I have found this from this is username. This is my email. Okay. So now what I'm going to do, I am going to save the password. Password has been saved. Now I am going to click on login and I will put admin and after admin i will use this password over there and boom i am logged in this was a simple step to forget the password and to recover it and how you guys can recover your password from the php my admin so let's go for it so what i will do that is another way i'm going to show you i will click on cpanel then i will go for the php my admin area and after php my admin I will have to check the database which database is linked with my WordPress so to check that currently we are having only one website and one database it is understood if we are having multiple websites or multiple functionalities on our website or multiple databases so who we can find let me show you for this we will go for the file manager and after this we will go for the public HTML and here you can find wp config i will open and i will click on edit and i will click on edit again and here you guys can find this is the database name hosting mart underscore wp457 so if i find that this is the only database okay so here i will click and i will go for a wp ry users I will click on that here you can find the username is login uh, admin and the user email is admin at the hosting mod dot show so I will click on edit and after this I can put my password in the user pass this is the user pass column and here I can put my password uh, let's make it little bit different from this like uh, I will choose something like this 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 okay I'll copy this I will paste it over there and then I will select MD5 over there and then I will click on go. So now you can see row is affected and it is successfully updated. So if I will refresh that pay now, it won't log in me over there. So now I can log in using my username and I will copy this password from here. I will 
select that and I will copy it and I will paste it over there and if you can click on this you can see the password and now I am clicking remember me and logging in see so I mentioned the two different easiest way to log in your cPanel there are more ways but I would prefer these two ways I hope these two ways can solve your issue to logging in your WordPress stay tuned for upcoming sessions thank you have a good day bye bye